Hey guys, just a quick video on how to buy Bitcoin over here in New Zealand or anywhere around the world if you are using localbitcoins.com. So basically, uh, log into your guys' account and uh, what you'll be greeted with is a screen like this. So I've got to buy around $190 worth of Bitcoin New Zealand. And um, I have to work with two things. So we're going to be working with local Bitcoins and I'm also going to work with a calculator called coindesk.com forward slash calculator so I'm going to my calculator first now um, I need to purchase about I need to purchase euro so I just change this tab to euro and I need to buy a hundred dollars worth of euro uh, with a bitcoin but um, I'm gonna add maybe five dollars so instead of getting a hundred I'll get a hundred and five worth of euro just to cover any fees that I may get and this is how much Bitcoin I need to buy 0 0.015377 at the at the going rate so I go back over here to local bitcoins and um, how I select my traders is I go for feedback 100% 99% it's still good you have to go with okay which bank are they banking with now I'm ASB so I can go with this one and this one and this one Always start with the top because the cheaper the Bitcoin price, the cheaper their fees are, all right? And the higher the fees are, the, that's how much they're charging for one Bitcoin. So you want to save as much as you can. Over here is the limit. So this guy, he, you can only Oof. buy $400 plus. This guy, you can buy $10 at least. Okay, so I'm going to use this guy. Um, his rates are good. His feedback's not too bad. It's only, you know, 99%. It's all good to me. Um, the traders coming on vacations out of bitcoins. All right, so we can't trade with them. Bugger. So I need to find somebody else in the range. Now the next one up, oh my gosh, is BNZ Cash Deposit. So I can't even use him. So I'm going to show more. All in New Zealand dollars. And let's have a look. We need a minimum of a hundred. That's BNZ. ASB, so I can use this guy, ASB, let's go and buy, oh my gosh, charging an arm and a leg, and all I do here is I enter the amount of Bitcoin, oops, I enter amount of Bitcoin, and we should be able to there we go so I need $188.59 perfect here are the terms now this is very important never ever ever put Bitcoin or crypto or cryptocurrency in as your reference never do it because you're you're putting these guys accounts at risk so I'm going to place the order now <clears throat> and I'm going to put ASB bank so send trade request That's how much we're buying. That's how much I have to pay. Now I need to wait for his bank account details. I've also got a cell phone number if I want to text. This green light over here indica indicates how long ago they were on local Bitcoin, so 12 minutes ago. And I also have so many minutes to complete this transaction. Here we go. 89 minutes left. All right, looks like he is. Um, no, nothing happening. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this on pause. Okay, guys, after a few minutes, he's just come back to me with his bank account details. What I've done is I've just obscured it um, just for uh, his reasons. So, I'm going to like uh, pay everything into the bank account and I'm also going to use. Take contact number as reference. Thanks. Okay, whatever that means. I, I'm assuming my contact number. So I'm going to use my cell phone. All right, so I'm just going to pop into my bank account, pay for this order. I need to pay $188.59. Okay, guys, so I've just sent payment for my bank account and I used my phone number as my reference. So I'm just going to tell him payment has been made. Um, if you can see the screenshot, but in this, this case I can't. So, payment has been made, could not take screenshot from my phone. 
that's it. So that's the transaction. It's all pretty much done and dusted. All I need to wait for is him to transfer my bitcoins. And I will pause the video uh, just until he transfers. It shouldn't take any moment. All he needs to do is go and uh, look at his bank account and check uh, payment. That's why it's good dealing with um, a bank account that the seller has. It's the same as, as yours because normally here in New Zealand, um, it transfer instantly. So putting the video on pause. Okay, so he's just released the um, bitcoins, which is awesome. They should appear in my Bitcoin account. So up here on the top right, you'll see B. And um, that's your Bitcoin wallet. It's not yet quite there but he is releasing it and our local bitcoins will put it into my bitcoin wallet and that is pretty much it um i will tell you for those that haven't joined local bitcoins you'll have to go through some kind of uploading of id so make sure you've got photo id make sure your guys bank account um matches you know the name you're paying from because some sellers get a bit icky with stuff like that you've got to pay from your own bank account this is my husband's one and also uh yeah just make sure you're doing all your id uh and once you've done it with one seller that's it you don't have to do it with them anymore but other sellers you may be required to so guys good luck and um yeah go go hard and go and buy your first uh bitcoin or bitties over and out